Spain, not what the experts predicted. It's happening in Spain now as well. According to official data, 82% of all COVID patients are fully injected and 92% of all COVID deaths there are fully injected folks as well. Now, this is a real mystery given that we've been consistently told, you know, that the injections protect folks from serious illness and death. In Spain, 81.66% of the population have been fully vaccinated. Now, even a fifth grader could tell you there's something wrong with the math in Spain. Seems like being an expert is much harder these days than it was, say, prior to the mass injection worldwide campaign. Given now we have a track record and data for the injections, both of which are pointing to problems. Now, I'm not sure if you knew this or not, but none of the clinical trials supporting vaccine approval measured or were even intended to measure hospitalizations and deaths. The clinical trials only measured infections. There have been no randomized clinical trials confirming that any of the vaccines prevented or even reduced hospitalization or deaths from COVID-19. The only measurement that the FDA relied on to approve the vaccines for emergency use was infections and the ability of the vaccines to stop transmission and the vaccines by the experts own admissions have not lived up to the billing on that. The experts continue to tout the benefits of injections on the anecdotal suggestion that they prevent serious illness and deaths. I, for one, would like them to test their hypothesis and run clinical trials and let's see what happens. After all, that's how science is supposed to work, right? Anyway, thanks for watching. I do appreciate it. Please post your comments in the comment section. As always, you can follow me on my Rumble as well as my Locals account, and I will see you next time.